I live again. Hey, how's it going? I wanted to get this video out for October, for my Inktober tradition, but it seems that I came down with a bad case of the shingles, which prevented me from being able to do anything even remotely productive for a better part of a week. So here's a late Inktober drawing for you guys. Today I'm going to be drawing everybody's favorite maniacal, dynamite-hurling, psychopathic gunslinger, Caleb from Blood. Released in 1997, Blood is a first-person shooter made in the build engine by Monolith Productions, who are also responsible for Fear and No One Lives Forever. Blood features some of the most fluid movement controls, satisfying gunplay, impactful sound design, and an atmosphere that makes an abandoned gothic cathedral look like Chuck E. Cheese. Blood to this day, in my honest opinion, manages to outclass a staggering amount of recent releases, and all of this accomplished on a primitive and outdated faux 3D engine from the 90s. Caleb here is an undead gunslinger who, as soon as the game begins, rises from the grave, quotes Army of Darkness, and goes on a blood-soaked, revenge-fueled rampage against the cult that betrayed him. Here, I wanted to depict Caleb dual-wielding the flare guns, a sadistic smile full of ill attempts slashing across his features, as he's probably about to partake in some guns akimbo action against a room full of enemies. Bit of irony here is that although I'm depicting Caleb, as if he's ready to kick ass and take names, Blood is in fact a very difficult game, at least on normal or higher difficulties. The level design and enemy placement is brutal, bordering on sadistic at times, and if you're reckless then you'll find that the game will bend you over and push your chocolate so deep that it'll start dripping out of your ears. The game is very punishing, to be sure, and I'd probably hate it if it wasn't so much fun. This game is truly one of the most satisfying challenges I've overcome, and I sincerely wish that I was able to play it when I was younger. A bit of a confession here. I've never played Blood before until this very year, when I bought Night Dive Studios Remaster on Steam. I can't speak for the quality of the original release, but I've still found that the remaster is a very fun gaming experience. It shouldn't come as a surprise that I'm quite fond of retro and throwback shooters. I'm just addicted to how these types of games feel. I love the movement, the hordes of enemies, the unrealistic amount of weapons you can carry, and the hunting for secrets. After experiencing shooters like this, I just can't imagine myself playing any type of slow-moving, cover-based, two-weapon shooters ever again. Besides all that, I don't really have much else to add. I'll just take this opportunity to say thank you for tuning in, and I hope to see you in a future video. If you have any questions, comments, or criticisms, please leave a comment. I'm more than happy to hear any kind of feedback, good or bad. I do want to improve, honestly, and I can't improve without feedback. So, without further ado, I'll just turn off my mic and let you guys enjoy the music.